stitch is called the hexagon and it's very pretty and it's very nice like for a hat because it's kind of fluffy it's kind of thick very very pretty and I think I'm going to cover a bag with this so this is what you want to do this is an odd number of stitches whatever amount you want and what you want to this is a number four worsted yarn and I'm using size 8 knitting needles I'm using the size needles that the yarn calls for so I'm going to cast on and an odd number of stitches let's see because I just want to show you you need to have a base row so let's see I have two four six eight let's do only nine and do the base row so here I have my base row and it's just knit so here we have three four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So that row you do only once and it doesn't count within the pattern. So row number one is that you want to knit one and then pick up the next stitch from the row below so right there so and then knit one normally and then knit one from the row below and knit one and knit the next one from the row below and then knit one and then knit the next one from the row below and knit the last one okay so row number two is that you want to knit the first one and then go find that loose strand that's on top because when you when you did the the pass from from picking up from the bottom you have that loose strand so pick up that strand that's a little loose on top together with the stitch put it on your right hand needle put your left needle in front and knit them together through the back so let's do that again we're going to knit one and then pick up that loose strand together with the stitch put it together put them on your right hand needle put your left needle in front and knit them through the back again knit one pick up that strand together with the stitch put them on your right hand needle your left hand needle goes in front and you knit them through the back again you knit one pick up that strand you see it's kind of loose pick up the next stitch put them on your right hand needle put your left hand needle in front and knit them through the back and knit the last one Okay, row three, first stitch you're going to pick up from the row below because you want to alternate them. So pick up from the row below and knit the next normally. Pick up from the row below, knit, and knit the next one normally, and pick up from the row below, pick up from the next one normally pick up from the row below knit the next one normally and pick up from the row below okay so the next row we do the same thing but we alternate them so pick up that strand that's loose together with this stitch 
put your left hand needle in front and knit them through the back and then knit the next one. Pick up the loose strand together with your stitch and knit them through the back. Knit the next, pick up the strand together with this stitch, put your left needle in front and knit them through the back. Knit the next stitch, pick up the strand and knit them through the back. Knit one, and the last one is that you pick up your strand, pick up your last stitch, put your left hand needle in front, and knit them through the back. And you repeat those four rows, and that's it, and it, it looks like so. And then when you want to bind off, just bind off normally, you know, just like you would normally bind off. And that would be like, okay, let's see here, okay, so knit one, and then knit the next, and that one you pass over, and that's it, knit the next, and this one you pass over, and that's it. That's, you know, you bind off normally, and this is the way it looks. It's so pretty. Well, thank you very much for watching. Please share us with your friends and like our page and subscribe. And I'll see you the next time. <laughs>